What is up everyone? We are back again with some more Stellar Blade. We're gonna pick up right where we left off. So, we have defeated the first boss and we've kind of traveled just a bit further to another campsite outside of that. Um, and now we ended up at this supply camp. In my opinion, means that there could be a boss coming up. So we already explored this just a tiny bit. We we there was like some dialogue right here. Um, we try to operate this. We can't. We need to turn on some type of power, I believe. Let's actually see in the menu. We can see the mission. Okay, no. It's, so it, it still just says we're doing that. Okay, but let's go ahead and continue. Getting the hang of the whole parrying system last time. See if we didn't ruin that momentum. over here just to see what there is all right I think that's it uh it's not parrying what is it called it's like certain moves where you kind of like dive under the enemy and you're able to counter attack them all those things feel super nice to do you have to reorganize the code in order to restore power Oh, okay, okay. Okay, I see that. And then the other thing that I'm enjoying a lot is like the sense of exploration. Exploring seems very rewarding in terms of finding loot. There's always something hidden. There's always a reason to go uh, a little bit out of the direction of, you know, just going straight to where you're supposed to go. Gotta concentrate for this one. So we're just spreading the numbers out as evenly as possible. There we go. I wonder if there's more than one way of doing that. That's great. Try activating the monorail panel again. But imagine so, right? Something is heading away. Don't worry. It's the monorail. This ancient electronic device is our transport. All right then. After you. Another flashback. It's just Taki. He's just thinking about Taki. Hey, are you alright? Oh, I was just remembering something from yesterday. I don't know why it seems like more time than one day has passed. This city, so quiet, and so lonesome. Well, that's what happens when a city becomes devoid of humanity. What are you going to do after you defeat the Alpha Nativa? All airborne squad members exist for one sole purpose. All we must do is complete the mission. You mean the extinction of all Nativas? Right? To think that the point of your existence is to snuff out another species. <laughs> no fun in that. That would be a weird mindset to be in. What else am I going to do?
One Legion squadron has about 20,000 troops and all of the equipment needed for their activities. Legions 8 and 15 were stationed in Edo 7. After the colony extinction, they were only about 3,000 troops. Those crossed out. I wonder how many will live to see the sunrise tomorrow. Right, let's see. Nano suit. The nano suit affects Eve's appearance. You can use collected design patterns and materials to craft nano suits. Collect a variety of nano suits and face the fate of this world in style. So can I do that now? Can I get a new suit or what? Like this used to be a plaza. You're right, except it's underwater now. The good thing is, you won't have to go in the water. The Hall of Records is that way. All right, we're finally nearing our destination. Let's see what's over here, though. Oh, we probably go that way, right? Campsite already? That's pretty fast. Not sure if there's anything we can... Nope. Nothing yet. It might be best to stay away from the water. Looks like there's electricity running through it. We do got some enemies here. Go ahead and take care of them. Oh, that's a big, big guy right there. There we go. See, whatever that's called, that feels super satisfying. this something is falling from the sky did we get any orbital bombardment warnings all right let's go for this thing oh Fallen soldier. Alright, we only need one more to increase that. Hey, how do we get up? There has to be a way to get up there, right? Oh, right here. <laughs> Uh, maybe the stairs? <laughs> there we go.
Though, I know I said not to go in the water, so what happens if I do? How can we said not to go? Oh, there it is. There it is. So maybe there'll, there'll be like some type of suit or something. That'll let me go into the water. Oh snap. Can we not make it up here? Oh my god. Whoopsie. It's funny that... I think both of my deaths... I think I've only died twice, pretty sure. And both of those deaths were just me unaliving myself. So like I said, I'm pretty sure at some point we'll get some type of suit. For now we will avoid the water. wonder if this is back where so at the very first area of the game there was a sec there was there was a place that we needed a code that we never got i wonder if it's that i go back Different type of exospine. Increases the damage and effect of combat. The moves powerful natibos are not affected. I think I like what we have on right now better. This must be the control device for the floodgate. You can only activate it with the right credentials. Let's come back later. We have things to do. Alright, I guess so. We got in here.
that an enemy in there? Yep, it is. So let's take care of these guys first. So that's where we're supposed to go. We made it. Uh, oh, we could Okay, so we could have just gone through here, huh? We went the long way. Because we're a little bit more adventurous. Another supply camp here. Adam, do you meet airborne squad members from the colony often? No, not really. Yesterday, I just happened to be around the area. I've never seen such a large scale airborne operation. Why did you save me? I'm not really sure. I just felt they're in love. Like I was meant to. It's hard to describe. It's just a short, intense feeling. I did you say for Adam? Huh. Oops. I didn't mean to do that. I don't want to fart fast travel right now. We got four areas that we can fast travel to. Ooh, new feature. Let's go. So this changes the appearance of Eve. That's it? There has to be some more to it, right? That looks pretty sick. Yeah, it doesn't seem like there's anything new about it at all. It's just literally the same suit, just a different color. Exospine. You can actually enhance this one. I guess we'll just do it since we can. What about skills? Might as well do this, so then we have everything. All the abilities. So from here, where are we supposed to go? That way. Jesus. Come on, Adam. You already know. So it seems like we would go this way. I kind of want to see what's over here. So somehow, some way, we should be able to get up there. Not necessarily right now, but at some point.
memory of a believer, a new unit will be dispatched from the colony. A long time has passed since the final war. Mother's fear finally answered our call. Death be upon those abominations. May our memory live on forever. May we find salvation. Can't we do that one attack? There it is. There it is. Alright, that's pretty cool. That's good to know that you can actually jump and then eventually you'll be able to do it. You don't have to be like standing specifically in one area to do it. That's a bit too far for that. How about you try jumping and dashing? Cutscene, cutscene, cutscene. Everything looks like an apocalypse. What? Nothing. Just talking to myself. Mini cutscene. In the area, the music of this area. We need to find a passcode for this. I need a four-digit password. Uh, another headache. Okay, this sign reads time. Could this be connected to the clock tower? <laughs> Oh, what? No way. Right, so what do you say it's connected to the, the clock tower we saw? Maybe head over there. Got body down here. Please, open. Open. Damn it, this isn't it. Right, the clock tower. It says the time is... A little hint there. I'm guessing we just take note of the time. And that should be the, the code. Is there anywhere else to go though, in the meantime? Yeah, it seems like we can come up here. Uh, we can't open this. Oh, but we got these rods. Okay. Uh, watch out! 
Oh. No. Was I supposed to make it? Are you okay? It's nothing. Did I mess up? No, I did mess up, I'm pretty sure. I can't get up there. Wait. Yeah, right? There's no way I can make this jump. Now, where's the clock? There. So it is... Oh, one. Oh, one. Five. Oh, one. Oh, five. Is that what it would be? I'm uh, not. Oh, not oh, one. Oh, five. Oh, one. Um, twenty five. Twelve twenty-five. Eve Protocol, Airborne Squad, Angel, all a bunch of bollocks. It shows that Mother Sphere puts on. It's a show that Mother Sphere puts on. They don't help us. Mother Sphere doesn't care about us. I was such a pathetic fool to wait for that so-called salvation. I have no more regrets. So either way, this would have just taken us over here. Huh. I can see the Hall of Records. We're almost there now. We can go that way. Why, why does that why does that happen? Got a campsite right here. Are these connected? Yeah. <laughs> Go ahead and rest up. Get our HP back up. Old square, then triangle? That. Let's just do that and see. Alright, I don't think we took care of these guys. All contact has been lost with other cities. Those bastards will eventually take over this place. It's the end for Earth. The only way to survive is to run away to the colony. If you want to stay and fight, do as you will. Go into the orbit elevator. Didn't see this right here. Drop down.
this all leading to the same area or is this actually a different area? I think this is the lady that I saw towards the beginning of this area. When I said we're gonna have to find a way to go up there at some point. Seems like it's me. Yeah, definitely. I'm glad that we did find it. We got something here too. Armor pack. Oh, it's for the drone. Alright, now we're good to go. I think I almost missed that area. to go that way. Is there anything? Oh, oh, I can open up this door. There we go. Nice little shortcut if needed. Almost there. Got that guy. Got a human. Seems like we still got some exploring to do. I apologize if I'm being annoying to the scanner, by the way. Uh, I mean, really how else are you going to find everything? If that's what you're going for, right? If you don't care then, you don't have to. Artemis 49, please find a way to back up and export data from the archive. If we're able to maintain even the copies of data, we can restore it later and connect to the network again. I scanned the credentials. Thank you. What is this? Oh, we can't get in. What's happening? It wasn't like this before. 
the system was put through a reset when the power was cut off. I'll have to verify the credentials once power is restored. Why don't we force our way in? Let's not do that. The safety system goes off. We'll never be able to enter. Come on, Eve. You gotta think a little bit. Let's definitely going down this here then. Lead to the power control room. It looks like the fusion cell's dead. Wait, I'm sensing another fusion cell around here. Oh, I did not see this guy. We have received a report that fusion drive is empty. Artemis 132, search the area and secure the fusion cell. Alright, this is the code to the power control room. Finally, the Hall of Records. the heck is this place? The Hall of Records. I can't believe we're in the Hall of Records. It's like a dream. Now, all we have to do is find the hyperdrive. At the start of the 22nd century, humanity's right to life was threatened by advanced global warming. Having foreseen this, Mother Sphere ensured mankind could meet this challenge. The eons-long process of natural adaptation resolved near instantly. The body cell replaced the heart and made it possible to survive in environments without oxygen or water. Thanks to advances in biotechnology and nanotechnology, the inconveniences of aging and disease were a thing of the past. This created giant leaps forward in the development of hazardous industrial spaces and space itself. We can now withstand the crushing pressures of the deepest oceans and even exit a space station without the need of a spacesuit. Wow. So they're kind of like androids essentially right humanity's greatest and only hope for survival can be found in mother sphere please enjoy the harmony and prosperity of ados 7 the first city ever built by mother sphere the mother of i have no idea what that was all about adam did it make any sense to you mankind's past was buried with the final war this must be a video from before that time. So even he doesn't know? Is this what you're looking for? Yes, you can expect.
Great. We accomplished our first objective. Let's go before the emergency power runs out. I wonder if he's lying. He does he does know more than what he's saying. There we go. Oh, come on. I was in the middle of attack. There we go. I missed it last time, but I got it that time. not that difficult. I was expecting more. You're gonna be totally exhausted before we even get to the Alpha. Over here. I can't believe the amount of times I fall for their, something like that. Oh, this is actually the way we're supposed to go. Let me actually backtrack a little bit. 
Oh, or is that the only way we can go? Oh, look. I don't know how I missed this right here. Artemis 49's reply. Mission failed. We clo we'll close off the archive and return to base. No, I pressed the wrong button. I pressed up in triangle instead of up in circle. This seems pretty useful. Make it easier to use blink and repulse. That seems useful too. Let's do that. And then let's do counter. Oh, I've been I did it wrong when I was doing it. So you press square to get the to do that and then triangle to go back at him. This one full triangle. Okay, we'll do that. Let me just practice this real quick too, just to make sure I, I'm understanding it correctly. God, I'm just missing all the parries. Got a robot. Oh, no, I missed it. Campfire. Okay. I guess we can take a look at the skills again, even though I literally just upgraded it, so. Yep. I didn't expect too much from that. No memory. 
Gotta go that Should way. We head down again? No, just follow the path and go straight. Construction We've zone. Quite far. How much more do we have to go? We just have to pass that sewage facility. That's far as hell, Adam. There must be a way to get across. We can build ourselves a bridge if we use that crane. Wait, so I am going the right way? I guess I am. Human. Gaging enemies. Those insect bastards are coming at us. I can't. There's no end to them. They're breaking through the defense line. Hurry and evacuate the citizens. We survive. Crossed out. Oh, this is where we just were. Exploring time. What? I did not see my sword glow blue. Dude, what? I did it. security box scene. There should be some treasure inside. We ought to beep. Let's look for the modules to upgrade the drone. Locked up tight. But the hacking tool should get it open before you know it. Beep. Let's look for the modules to upgrade the drone. Locked up tight. But the hacking tool should get it open before you know it. <laughs> So, sounds like we're going to be able to upgrade our drone. What? Can't get on that? Oh my god. Potential blast? What is this? It doesn't seem useful, but it looks intriguing. I'll look into it later. You can discover hidden cans by exploring different places around the world. Good things might happen whenever you collect a certain number of cans. Interesting. Oh my god. Alright, let's try to angle this right, I guess. I go up there, so... Yeah. 
What a fail. Oh my god, the enemies deliver multiple strikes after glowing red. Use parry slash perfect parry to defend yourself. The new enemy right there. Get down quickly or no? Definitely not. The robot. Get back. Get up there. This guy. Oh my god, that was so close. I don't know how I didn't take any damage to him. I definitely should have. Yes, yes, yes. You've said that already. All the exploring, Adam. Damn. There we go. Playing a little bit more carefully right now just cuz I have no no more health. The lift should work. Oh, it's one of these things. I hope they get harder. It's a really cool concept. But, I mean, for me, not too difficult. And I'm not just for me, right? Like, for most people, I'm assuming it's not too difficult.
boss. Can you use this? God damn it. There we go. Hey, there's still so much to explore. Alright, hypothetically, what happens if we come here? needed for the crane then they should be nearby i'll look for the closest one first i'm already getting ahead of myself okay you can take your time yeah i don't know if i want i want to rest but i don't because like I've already taken out a good amount of enemies. Don't want them to respawn. I've seen a movie like this before. It was a film where, with a predictable storyline about mankind winning against alien monsters that invaded Earth. Start of the movie. The monsters slaughter humans left and right. Even armed soldiers aren't able to do anything until the main character appears. We're playing that the role of those soldiers. Damn. I wonder if we can sneak up on this thing. Oh, nope. Oh, nope. Man, I wasted that. Damn. I gotta get back. Really don't want to die, that's for sure. I don't need a hint. I'm good. Boring. So now I think we are good to come up here.
I wonder what it looked like before the war. Hmm. What do you think it looked like? Well, probably upright buildings, well manicured flora, and living people. That's it? You have no imagination. Then again, I guess you've never been here before. Imagine bustling streets, crystal clean air, and people smiling everywhere you look. Have you ever seen something like that before, Adam? Yes. A long time ago. Long, long time ago. Eve, are you ready to leave? I just wanted to imagine what you were telling me. It's hard to imagine. Let's go. Guessing this is where the other ID is gonna be. Just one more. We can, we can make this jump, right? Oh my gosh. Must that we weren't gonna make that. Oh my god, Eve, what are you doing? Alright, last area. Here. There's a guy right here, right? Oh, what's going on? One more enemy right here. Code name Gigas. Gigas? Is that how you say it? Code name Gigas has finally sighted. Sharing coordinates now. For the for reference, Gigas is stronger than any Nativa we've encountered so far. Team Athena, get ready and head to the operation site. Ah, she. No. Alright, we should be able to finish it off right here, though. Oh, God. No, let's back up. Oh my god, there's so many attacks that I don't see come. I think he's done attacking and he keeps going.
All right, don't. Oh, there's something up here. I think so. All right, we got all three ID cards now. Nice. Now use them on the panel. Now let's go ahead and activate this thing. Now I'm not worried about them all coming back. Rest up. Adam, I have a question. What is it? The hypercell. If it sustained the Hall of Records until now, it must be a huge source of energy. Yes. Even compared to a fusion cell. Then where are you planning to use this energy? Oh, well, it's kind of a long story. But I can explain more when you come back. I don't know. Loud and clear. Tricking us? I don't think so, but a little odd. Oops, not what I meant to use. Now we should have. Okay, yep. Go ahead and use the shop, and now we can purchase more of these things. Definitely should be able to level up. Alright, I think I'm gonna go with this uh, chain attack. Attack power increase, always good. Count for a rechargeable tumbler increase. Oh, that's super good. Do this one. I can see myself using that one more than this one. I know we have to just do this, but I'm gonna go ahead and end it there. I think a good place to end at. See what happens afterwards. Uh, but yeah, really, really good progress, I think. Beat the second boss without dying. Okay, so, pretty good. I still think. Oh no, I have died one time to an enemy. And that was just honestly my fault in terms of not healing up. I got a little too cocky, you could say, I think. But other than that, I think I've been doing pretty good. Um, the parrying is a little difficult, especially because you have to parry multiple times, depending on how many how many times the enemy attacks you. Um, so it can be a little a little difficult to to know how many attacks they're gonna throw out at you. At least for me, I still haven't learned their patterns. I'm sure, you know, some people are probably gods at this game already. <laughs> uh, but yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Really appreciate it. Please like and subscribe. And peace.